Here we go again. Should I buy or say bye bye? Spanish Lake Edition. We up in North County. Got a little cute little house here to check out. Um, it's on a cul-de-sac, so that kind of helps. Um, it looks like it's a pretty decent property from a distance. Matter of fact, let me make sure I get a good shot of that. Let's see how that looks. Looks good there. Roof looks good. What's up, Ernesto? What up, real estate stepper? I see ya. So we got an opportunity to buy this property here. Should be empty now. Look like I got a garage, a one car garage at least. What up, Maya? What up, what up? Zona. Yeah. Don't look too bad back here. Cute little yard. Check out the front. Let's see what it looks like. What's cooking? There was a neighbor next door. <laughs> like, who is it? So I want to get into real estate, but don't know where to start. Well, what I would say is to join the Future Cash Flow Club. It's a community of investors where we talk about wholesaling, we talk about creative deal structuring, buying houses subject to, all of the creative stuff that everybody's talking about. You don't need a real estate license or any of that. Wow, where do I sign up? Well, I would say go to futurecashflowclub.com. That's futurecashflowclub.com. You can even get a free trial. Try it out today. Hello. Oh, okay. Not bad. What up, what up? Open floor plan. Sounds like it was a uh, single girl tail up in here. I heard that beeping. You can leave that open. Yeah. Let's see here. Is this granite? Some granite countertops. This is like the same stuff I just put at that house over there in uh, Florissant. Got an island. Let's see what we got here. We got lights. Yeah, let's see what we got here. Where's the handles to the, uh, do we need handles to the cabinets or is it just me? This refrigerator stay? This is like our refrigerator. It's cleaned out. No know sodi pops in there. With the twin cooling. We got do we got a garbage disposal? Yep. Yeah. Like it's been a little bit of moisture getting down there, but who knows? Alright, that sounds good. Cute little fixture there. So here we go. I don't know what happened there. Somebody ripped that off the wall. Maybe they had a TV there. But that's the living room. Open floor plan. Yeah, we got a master bed back bedroom back here. Let's see. That light looks dull. But it's a pretty big size room. Carpet. You could put a king size bed in there if you wanted to. Single girl tail just went off. Beep. What's that? Oh, why is it down there? No smoke detector supposed to be up. Why they got it on the ground for? All low. I guess if it go off down there, you know you're in trouble. Yeah, I don't really have to do anything for this house. I don't think nothing major it don't look like. So this is a potential creative deal. Creative and innovative. Where is the light in here? Oh. That's what the bathroom look like. A mosaic floor. Not bad. Oh, that's CO2. Look at Chris. He always knows stuff. Senior. He called me junior. <laughs> Does this house have a basement? Because if this is the living room and the kitchen, that's a two bedroom right there, right? Two bedroom, one bath. I thought this was a three bedroom. Maybe this is only a two bedroom. And I thought it was two baths. Maybe there's another bath downstairs. Here we go to the dungeon. Oh, it's finished basement. Another beep. That, that's CO2 too? Nah, man. All I mean, CO2 is it? Let's say. What that say? I don't know. But here's the unfinished side of the house. 
And here's the finished side. You can put a whole nother person down here. You can't escape in the event of a fire though because of that window. So if there's something down here considered to be a bedroom, it is not a bedroom. Because all those steps to get up out of here, that's the only way out of the basement. I mean, it's a good rec room, but this is not a bedroom. Officially. This is officially not one. Let's see what we got here. Can we get some light in here? Oh, there it is. It's just a little baby room. A little office. Okay. Cute little office. Here's your room. You can make your studio. I mean, does everything in here... They didn't replace not one battery. Now, that's a smoke detector there. They, ain't, they got like six of these things going off. Ain't that something? What is this on the wall? This was a studio. Oh, that's a wallpaper. Somebody had a uh, little studio going in here. And then out here, just the open space. This kind of reminds us of our basement a little bit, huh? Yeah. So that's what we got. That's where we're from, y'all. If y'all wondering, St. Louis in the building. You know who we is. You know where we at. Now over here to the stuff that costs you money. Honey, oh, there is a bathroom down here. But this is not a bedroom. This is a 2-2. Two -two. It's not a 3-2. It's a 2-2. Two -two. And then this bathroom looks like it needs a little help. Nothing major. A little bit of floors. So what do you think so far? Should I buy or say bye-bye? Is that mold? That's mold like a mofo. I don't even know if they can be cleaned out or they need to be replaced or what. Definitely old and musty. Why are you getting fuzzy? Quit it. Yep, her code has to be at ground level. Oh, that's a new code they got over here. See, I'm not up with all the codes. To be honest, I don't know all that stuff. I just go in here and, and pray that it works. So let's see here. Stacks. Looks like they're not too old. They're not old copper. Water heater has seen its better days. Furnace has seen its better days, but it's working. It's not new, but it'll make it do what it do. And we got more space over here for storage. They left a bed down here. Look at that. A queen size bed. Throw that on the internet. Get about 200 bucks for that over there in the corner. Because you know when we buy the house, we take it as is. Don't touch nothing. Uh, how old is this water heater? Let me see. Can you see? Older than me. 1923. No, I don't know. Mm. 34,000 BTUs. So, yeah. Mm. I don't know what's all this stuff dripping off of there. What's that about? Plumbing look good. So, yeah, that's the house. I'm going to turn these lights off so I don't run their bill up. But that toilet looks like it's stank. That need to be something going on with that. So this little bathroom can need a little work. It don't have to be anything major. If you're talking about flipping it, but I wouldn't flip this. I would keep this property long term and make it burn like a perm. Did I turn that light off? Was there a light on there? Oh, that light. I didn't even turn that light on. So yeah, that's what we got, ladies and gentlemen. The backyard, if you can peek through. I'm gonna go back outside if you wanna see it. But where is the, uh, I mean, is this supposed to have no handles on here? Is that the type of drawer it is, I guess? Well, you're supposed to have handles and somebody just never put nothing on here. I guess you just pull it from the bottom like that. I don't know, where's the handles? Even though it's a simple little thing to fix, but it's something to fix. That's how you get your negotiation. Say, hey, I gotta buy them handles, man. Them handles high, man. You know how much handles going for now? So yeah, this the house, main bedroom. Second bedroom. Bathroom. What kind of work they did right here? Put that light at again. Come on, put the wrong light. That one. Does this look crooked or something, or just funny looking? I uh, guess. Whoever did that work. Some tile work. A new toilet. That helps. Hey, Chris, is that you? What's going on down here? So, yeah, I think I will buy this one. We'll see, though. It's a creative deal. How it sits, it really does not cash flow as you would want it to. Cause I think the payments are like 
kind of close to the rent, so I wouldn't want to get too deep into this. I think the payments were, I don't know, like around a thousand dollars, and I only could get a rent for about a little over that. So yeah, I'll go ahead and submit my offer for this, and uh, we'll see what happens. But not too much to do in here. Need another quick look outside real quick, quick, quick. Find more leads than you can even process. That's multiple listing service. That's the MLS for you real estate agents. Absentee owner information. Find the cash buyers and flippers in any market nationwide. Pull a pre-foreclosure list. And don't forget, you got to find those comps. Get nationwide access with multiple filters powered by PropStream at WokeSource.com. Get your seven-day free trial today. WokeSource.com. That's WokeSource.com. I guess I should uh, pull that up and turn the lights off in a minute. Look around back. See if there's anything else I need to fix. Need a smoke detector battery. Hey, they must cost costing twenty dollars each now. That's my uh, that's my negotiation point. Hey man, we gotta put all the batteries up in there. They got cameras all around the house. I know that. She's probably looking at me right now. I see you walking around with a video. I see your crafts. You do. Yep. AC looks good. Red. Rude. Red. The garage looks good. Roof on the garage looks good. Nice little patio area to shade it. Looks to be in pretty good shape. Let me step back. Yeah, roof looks good all the way around. So really, what's wrong with this house? It just needs a new buyer, and that buyer may be me. Uh, I might take it down, but you know, I don't want to get too deep into it. Uh oh, oh, we got stuff in here. G Raj. Somebody storing beds in here. Oh, that's a nice dresser too. Tell me, leave all that here. We'll take it all. Oh, they're probably coming back to get their stuff. But it's a one-car garage. Is this electrical? Nope, this is manual lift. This is not an electrical pull-up kind of garage door, so you gotta manually lift it. Yep, so I'll just move that and put that back. So there you go, ladies and gentlemen. I'll let you know what happens with this if you wanna learn more on how you can actually find opportunities like this, as well as buy opportunities like this. Make sure you check out futurecashflowclub.com meet weekly we go deep into the weeds talking about the paperwork talking about structuring the deals talking about helping sellers and buyers make real estate deals future cash flow club .com. do what you do be who you be and i'll see you before you see me Boom, 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 You may have heard the saying, the fortunes are in the follow-up. Now there's a brand new system that is great to help you cold call, text message, drop voicemails, and so much more, all automated. You don't have to remember anything, just set it and forget it. All you have to do is speak to people. Check it out, wokereply.com. It's a multi-touch marketing campaign where you can schedule to send text, voicemail, email, and even live calls all on autopilot. Check it out today, wokereply.com. That's wokereply.com.